Virgo. Uh oh, welcome back to your weekend reading. Let's see what your messages are for the weekend, August 2nd through the 4th. Okay, if you want to get a personal reading, there's a link in the description box below the video. As you know, I also have some other readings in uh, the description box, other links. You can check those out if you want to become a member of the channel. Also, $2.99 per month. All right, enough. Let's get into your weekend. Oh, shit. Okay. First thing, Virgo, you've got a vacation. You will be traveling soon. So you're either going to find out about this over the weekend or um, you're going this weekend somewhere. A little vacation, packing up your bags. Could be a road trip. Could be with, a, could be with an air sign. Uh, it could be with a friend. Oh, wow. Yeah. Um, I feel like it's a friend. He or she calls you up. Hey, offers you, like, there's an invite. You want to go do this thing? You want to go hang out? You want to go on this vacation with me? Um, somebody also apologizes to you for something and books a trip. Apologize to some, apologizes and books a trip. Okay. Or lets you know, like, here's a gift. I want to apologize. This is my, this is my, like, way to make it up to you, right? The, whoever, okay? Air sign energy. Maybe you do this. You might do this. Um, I'm also hearing a rain check. Somebody, like, gives a rain check. All right, let's see. Oh, it could be a mom. Mom and a sister. Father and a son. Energy uh, with a mother figure. Could be your mother. Mom's coming back from vacation. Or you find out about this. She's coming back sooner from where she's been, I'm hearing. Um, or someone close to you that's like a mother figure as well. Let's take a look. Let's see. Okay. Been looking around at places to go. Been doing some research. There's somebody um, who's away from you. Or has been away from you and is having a hard time they're struggling um they want to come home is what i'm hearing somebody wants to come home um or go somewhere with you virgo okay it could be a king of cups as well cancer scorpio pisces libra gemini aquarius um yeah so something to do with like traveling somewhere it doesn't have to be an actual vacation it could be but it's something to do with traveling somebody's traveling in your direction either they're coming this weekend or you find out about it this weekend okay or vice versa you get invited okay all right so you got gold digger <laughs> i ain't seeing she a gold digger but she ain't messing with no broke broke okay they want your money somebody wants your money what the where was like what money <laughs> just kidding somebody's somebody wants your money Ooh, i don't know if that's connected to that first part but um okay hmm what the all right so there's somebody's not going to ask you for money but they're 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 gonna they're thinking of ways to ask to approach you or try to get some money from you or get something from you of value something about being used you might be feeling like too virgo that somebody only wanted you for your money you could be feeling that way like somebody used you you made some compromises maybe with somebody and you helped somebody out with money and now you're trying to now you're trying to balance your finances and it's a bit of a roller coaster some of you are like maybe kicking yourselves because you lent somebody money you were trying to help and there might have been a love situation involved in this they took your money um now you're trying to now you're trying to recover your losses or try to get the money back from this person okay taking a while but they all right so so, so if so, if you let money out to somebody okay Virgo, um, they're going to pay you back. I, I do, f yeah, I feel like, but it's going to be a really long time. I mean, they're going to reach out to you and say, hey, I know I owe you this money, so I'm going to pay you back in like, I don't know, December. 
and you start making payments but you might be like yo no you need to give it to me now so there is going to be like a payback here if you're trying to like recover your losses i feel like you'll be able to get some money coming in there's some good news about that you know if you need a loan or if you you put out a lot of money and you're trying to like somebody ran away with it and you couldn't they left you stuck if you're trying to find a way to fill your bank back up i feel like if you're applying somewhere you ask for help or that kind of thing i feel like you're gonna get yeah you're gonna get the help but whoever this person is this could have something to do with child support this might have happened to you years ago could be happening to you now or you could be connected to someone um that you know the other person is using them for their money a lot of shady activity yeah a lot of shady activity okay so be aware of that over this weekend if you think someone's trying to take money from you pay attention they might be telling you that they need it for school or um something that they're working on or they need it for their kid or or you know something along those lines just it's shady it's sketchy so keep that in mind okay you also have commitment kind of same as yesterday things are getting serious someone's quietly hopeful about you uh water sign could be a pisces it could be an aquarius someone's very hopeful here they're praying they're praying they're secretly praying but they're they're not showing it they're really hopeful that you know you're going to want to say yes this is what i'm hearing to some kind of commitment so right this could be somebody new that you meet um sure it could be somebody that you're currently involved with there could be um, no conversation here with the four of swords because this is retreat but there is some kind of this per there is someone here who's secretly hopeful that you will either give them a chance or you will say yes to the dress or yes to the ring or whatever this is long-term security this four of pentacles so they're saying this person wants to be with you they want you only you nobody else you're like a wish come true for them just a couple more cards yeah this person's on fire for you virgo Ooh, wow they're obsessed with you Ooh, <laughs> big old ace of wands right there is a very strong physical attraction yeah, so are they going to reach out to you this weekend? I don't think so. I don't see anything here. There's a potential new start with someone. I don't see anything here about reaching out because there's the four swords. It's just like nobody's talking. But it's a secret. Like, I mean, maybe it's not time. It could be a timing thing. Okay? And that's why I don't think you're here. You're going to hear anything. You guys, I'm so tired. I don't even feel like shuffling. <laughs> so I'm just going to do the old good old tarot shuffle here. Okay, patience. There you go. Everything will unfold in divine timing. So there is a timing issue happening here with this per with another person. Um, I think eventually they are going to reach out and make that offer. They're just ready for that new growth. And they're, they're like crazy physically attracted to you. There's, there's a sexual obsession. Go slow. Take time to get to know each other and balance one person given too much in the relationship. So, yeah. I mean, I feel like slow your roll, Virgo. Just chill <laughs> this weekend. Just chill. Okay, just relax. Just try to, you know, waste away in Margaritaville. Whatever you need to do for yourself this weekend. Just chill. Relax. Um, that balance, giving too much might have been if you gave someone money or too much time so it's always time effort and money right so you either gave too much time you gave too much effort you gave too much money to somebody here and um you're seeking balance i see you or you need to okay someone's in your life teach you a spiritual lesson or you're teaching them one there is chemistry with someone for sure chemistry and compatibility two different things you could have all the chemistry in the world but if you're not equally yoked got to be equally yoked all right let's see i'm going to give you your let's look at the chinese signs to see who's showing up 
uh, the person with the vacation and the person with the commitment and the person uh, with the, with the, uh, the gold digger. All right, year of the pig, year of the monkey, year of the horse, year of the dog in reverse. I guess that would be a wolf. Year of the goat, year of the rooster, year of the tiger, and the year of the rabbit. Okay, so that could be you. It could be your person. Or it might not be any of you. doesn't mean the reading's not for you. All right, let me see. Pull out of the deck here. One special message for Virgo. Oh, you got the Knight of Cups, Virgo. Romantic, flirtatious, introspective, introspective, a fickle lover, falling in love, being swept off the feet, a sudden love affair, a lack of balance in a relationship, situations or topics that make your heart flutter, a love of art and poetry. See, so you have the Knight of Cups coming in. There is a, some type of a romantic energy coming towards you over this weekend. Someone's in love with you. I'm just going to say that. There is someone you might, I know Virgo, you're like looking around like what if, if Virgo, some Virgos are like, nobody loves me. Others are like, yeah, we know everybody loves us. So whoever you are, <laughs> there's one particular person that loves you. They really love you. I don't, you know, are they capable of showing love that that's a different tarot reading, but there are feelings. Somebody does have feelings for you and it could be a water sign, possibly a Pisces either in love you, with you or does love you. I spill a lot of drinks though. Um, okay, they're just telling me, don't cry over spilled milk, Virgo. They're saying, don't don't cry over spilled milk. Just clean that shit up, move on, whatever that means. A um, Couple of hidden messages here for Virgo. Okay, I want you, I feel you leaving me behind and you speak to me through music. Somebody understands you through music or uh, singing. Or songs, something like that. All right, is there anything else Virgo needs to know? Let me just get one of the moon pie cards, a lustful, fiery spirit telling you that's that knight of wands. The sun is really hot to trap for you. Oh, they're just giving me that old Usher song. You got it bad. Remember that song? I can't sing it because I can't remember it, but I can hear his voice in my head. You got it. You got it. It's so 2006. You got it bad when you do, 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 do. Something like that. Anyway, maybe that's the song that you resonate with. All right. One money card. What's going on with finances? over the weekend wow you got wealth you are working towards real wealth prosperity in your life keep investing in yourself and look into long-term career planning so you got wealth coming towards you there's like a pot of gold at the end of the rainbow here virgo keep investing in yourself so whatever you're doing whether it's in business a career um, anything mental emotional physical or intellectual keep investing you're gonna hit payout you're gonna hit pay dirt that's what they're saying you're working towards investing in yourself so keep that up okay all right double gemini here showing up in your reading i have a cancer twice th three times once, twice, three times a cancer. And you have Virgo, another Virgo. Okay, September 8th. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, sorry. August 29th. <clears throat> uh, September 11th and the 16th. August 31st. Okay. Someone is 50. So when I call out these numbers, um, it's either going to be age or year of birth. It depends. So we have 55, 41, 66, 70, 49. Oh, August 23rd is here. September 4th is here. 73, 34, 90, 86, 
56. Okay, September, significant, April through September. Oops, very significant time period for you in your life. Major transformation, Virgo, making big gains. Uh, somebody's Jewish. We have the name Jennifer. Um, someone's in showbiz or is working on their business. Someone's at the zoo or going to the zoo. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Someone's a BK. You're getting like some, getting a Burger King, getting a burger at the BK. <laughs> hmm. All right, I'm hearing roll the dice, Virgo. Someone's checking the Dow, the Dow, like the stock market, S&P, I guess the Dow Jones, I'm hearing. Initials KD, we have ZI. Someone's Asian, KW, JE, we have letter D. Someone's bisexual. Z, letter Z, letter A, D, I, B, J, E, W, K. Okay. All right. This is a short reading tonight, y'all. Short, short reading. What the? What the heck's going on here? Okay. See, now this is like a flower, right? But to me, this kind of reminds me of like a Chinese star like a weapon. I forget what those things are called. I never remember the name. Isn't it like, is Chinese or Japanese? Um, so somebody has like, all right, so they're showing me it hanging on somebody's wall. It's like a bouquet of flowers, but it's made out of metal. So it would be like industrial decorations or home decor. They're telling me somebody has industrial home decor. All right, now, Got a bunch of bananas, Virgo. You know what? I'm allergic to bananas. I love bananas so much, but I can't eat them. There's something in some enzyme or something in bananas that when I was 40, I was like, nope, not having it anymore. Can't do it. They make me like wretched, my stomach. But anyways, there's something here with bananas. Um, you might also, they're saying you could be getting a lot of repeat phone calls from unknown numbers over this weekend, or you have been getting them. A lot of repeat phone calls from unknown numbers. All right, so there is some kind of connection. It could be your favorite fruit, you know, bananas, or you're having a banana or something with banana in it. Okay, so you have an infinity symbol. Yep, what comes around goes around. Virgo, that's a message for somebody here. What comes around goes around. Remember that. Okay, you also have a sun. Oh, okay. So I'm seeing someone on a, a, a ship, like a cruise ship. They're looking out like a, a porthole window and looking at the sun. Yeah, the, I see them like looking out. I, obviously, there's water everywhere, but I see someone looking out and there's like, you know, like a, a, a port. That's, it could be a portal. Oh, oh, okay, wow, crazy. They just said no, it's a song. Um, Black Hole Sun. Who's, oh, Sound Garden. Black Hole Sun. Somebody, I guess, maybe liked that song? I don't know, or the sun gets sucked into a black hole? That's not a prediction, y'all. Okay. You also have a Navy Star. So there is a connection, they just said, to Navy SEALs. Some connection to Navy SEALs. Or you'll see something in regards to a, the Navy SEALs over this weekend. You could be a Navy SEAL yourself. Or maybe you have, I don't know, I guess, what do you retire from that if you're older? Or you have someone you know. There's a connection to Navy SEALs. When I call out these qualifiers, if you're new, these are really just to give you confirmation that this reading is for you, more confirmation. There's a lot of different confirmations here, but just keep that in mind when I give these out. Not everybody has a connection to the Navy SEALs, I, I understand, but someone here might. 
Okay, so short and sweet, going to leave it here. Have a great weekend. And uh, thanks everybody for being in the chat. I hope you enjoy it. Save it in your playlist so you can come back and listen to it throughout the weekend. And uh, don't forget, click the links for personal readings. And I have a lot more hours open, you guys. So I will see you all back here on Sunday. All right, take care. Bye. Shut